I don't believe in a god at the moment. However, um, I don't like the, uh, the, 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 the antagonism that, 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 that occurs or is produced by this question. I mean, what you can say if, you, if you're a cosmologist, what you should say is, so, so we know that the universe was very hot and dense 13.8 billion years ago. Uh, we don't know how it got hot and dense. We don't even know, actually, if the universe had a beginning in time. Don't know. So um, that, that, to me, is where the, the, the science, science starts. I, I, I do not believe there's any evidence for a creator. There, there certainly isn't no evidence. You know, the, the, the point is that the correct thing to say is we don't even know whether the universe had a beginning. I don't even know whether it was eternal. Nobody does. So, so that, that was the point I was making. I think we're, over, we're stepping into a, an area where we don't really need to be. Great, great so, Richard Feynman, the great Nobel Prize winner. He, he, it's a beautiful quote where he says that, um, he, he says, what is the meaning of it all? <laughs> and, he said, uh, and he says, in the end, we have to admit that we do not know. But in admitting that, we may have found the open channel. That's the key to science. We don't know.